Planning out which sockets and switches you require for your home or project can lead to many different questions around the finish, style, and functionality. In this video, we discuss the difference between single pole and double pole switches and answer some common questions. Post simply, a switch is a device that is used to control the flow of current within an electrical system. There are two different types of switches, the single pole and the double pole switch. It's also important to understand the difference between a pole and a throw as both single and double pole switches can have a different number of throws which change how they work. The pole of a switch refers to the number of separate circuits that the switch can control. Single pole switches control just one circuit whereas a double pole switch can control two circuits. So a double pole switch is almost like having two single pole switches controlled by the same switch. A pole refers to the number of circuits that one switch can control for one operation of the switch. The throw indicates the number of contact points. The two most common types are single throw and double throw. Single pole switches are common, simple light switches. They are used to control one circuit and offer regular off and on function. Most switches in a typical home tend to be single pole, whereas double pole switches are more common in industrial settings. A double pole switch controls two separate circuits. These types of switches make it possible to isolate appliances safely. Double pole switches also tend to be used for appliances with heavy loads like cookers and showers. The wires that feed electricity to double pole switches tend to be larger than the wires that feed to single pole switches, as double pole switches are often used to control 240V circuits. Furthermore, it can be used as a safety shut off for residential appliance. It is important that you check the rating of your product, however, as there are various types of Dell Pole switches. A 20 Dell Pole switch is likely to be only suitable for small ovens, whereas regular ovens are likely to need a 45 DP switch. Dell Pole switches make it possible to isolate appliances safely. They tend to be used for appliances with heavy loads like cookers and showers. It is important that you check the rating of your product, however, as there are various types of Dell Pole switches. A 20 Dell Pole switch is likely to be only suitable for small ovens, whereas regular ovens are likely to need a 45 DP switch. Dell Pole switches are often used for appliances that require heavy loads. For example, cookers and showers. Dell Pole switches can also be used as a safety shut off for a residential appliance. Another reason to use a Dell Pole switch is due to regulations that mean you need to have local means of isolation for certain products. So the Dell Pole isolator isolates one particular socket that is behind a fridge for example. Dell Pole switches are often used for appliances that require heavy loads. For example, cookers and showers. Dell Pole switches can also be used as a safety shut off for residential appliance. If you are looking to buy sockets and switches, we have two useful guides on choosing the right ones for your home. They include matching switch and socket finishes to interior design styles and switch and socket function and selection. If you've made your mind up then go ahead and browse our collection of Dell Pole switches. What is a Dell Pole socket? A Dell Pole socket switch is both the live and neutral to ensure safe isolation of the plugged-in appliance. How does a Dell Pole switch work? A Dell Pole switch switch is both the live and neutral to ensure safe isolation of the low circuit. How many wires can be on a single pole switch? In theory, you would only have one two permanent life feeds and one plus load lives. There are a number of different ways to wire lighting or isolation circuits, so there could be a number of different combinations. A switch module does not require grounding, but the yoke and faceplate must always be grounded if the faceplate is made from metal. Most plastic switch plates do not need grounding due to it being a class 2 product. Once the single pole socket is generally cheaper, it is always preferred that customers or electricians install double pole sockets for safer isolation of the plugged in appliances. Single pole sockets are perfectly legal and are safe for many appliances, but it is safer to use double pole sockets. Therefore, it is always better to use double pole sockets in all situations. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.